Hello everyone! In this video, as I think you have already guessed, I will tell you different ways to film your content about BMG Drive. For example, if you shoot beautiful accidents in the game or races, chases and so on, then you should watch this video. So I have three different ways for you to shoot. From the simplest to the more professional, more beautiful, but more complex. Let's start with the first method. First of all, for all your filming, you will need to remove all UI apps. To do this, you need to press the key combination at the same time, namely Alt plus U. It is also possible that you have this action set to Shift plus U. If Alt plus U doesn't work, then try it. Here, as you can see, when I press this case, this digital speedometer appears or disappears. Now let's move on to the first method of shooting. To configure it, we need to go to Settings, Camera, go to External Camera and change its settings to Always TV. This will make your shooting more beautiful. Then exit the settings and press the number 4 on the keyboard. The external camera mode is activated and now you can start filming right away. The camera will show your car in a movie, so you can watch it in the game. Here is what the video shot in external mode looks like. I just turned on this mode and drive the car, nothing else. The main disadvantages of this type of shooting is that it is very uncomfortable to drive the car and the camera chooses what to shoot, so you can miss some accident and not shoot it. The second method of shooting, which I consider the least productive, but maybe someone will like it, is the method of using a free camera. That is, when you shoot what you want. And to activate the free camera, you need to press the key combination Shift plus C. Here is an example of how you can shoot with a free camera. You can configure your free camera in the photo mode tab, and you can adjust the speed and smoothness of movement, as well as the viewing angle. Usually I advise you to set the viewing angle to 45 degrees. This is the best option. Here is another example of using a free camera to film your videos. But now let's move on to the most professional method of shooting. This method uses replays. Therefore you need to go to UI apps tab, add an app, enter replay in the search bar and add this app to the screen. This is what it looks like. The rest is very simple. You press this red button, the recording starts, you just need to drive your car and then if you need it, it crashes into something and well, so on. Then when you recorded everything, you think it's enough, you click on this red square to end the recording. And now for the most interesting part. You can move the recording slider as you like. At the same time, you can change cameras, viewing angles, switch to cars in traffic and so on. In short, you can do everything to make your recording nice and realistic. I made another recording, and with the right choice of cameras and locations you can make a very, very nice video. I tried it, and this is what it looks like. 